I'm going to share to you some tips on how to pass the licensure examination for teachers or the so-called LEP. But before we start, I just want to congratulate the takers of this year 2020 kahit na may mga pangyayari ngayon or this pandemic kahit na postpone ang kanilang exam but still congratulations for passing the lab kasi advance ako mag -isip. claim it guys because I do believe that God will provide and God will answer your prayers fighting before I continue please don't forget to subscribe so I passed the licensure examination for teachers last September 2019 so first take lang sa awa ng Diyos so this serves as my proof that I passed the exam so this is my license and I cannot find my pin because it was misplaced I just insert a picture here so disclaimer lang I am not expert when it comes to this but I'll just share what I did as I took the examination based on my experience kasi naging effective ito sa akin so tip number one set your goals or look for a motivation isipin mo na you will take this let just once not twice but just once you don't want to repeat right that's why you should put it into your mind or motivate yourself that you can do it and the most important thing that you should learn is to believe in yourself believe in yourself that you can do it in the first day one take only put that into your mind because i truly believe in the love attraction the more you think the more it happens so if nagaka you feed your mind's all the negativity so puro negative thoughts lang ang nasa isipan mo so that's very wrong so next is look for a motivation so the question is bakit ka pa nagtitake ng board exam para saan para kanino of course for yourself and for your family as you pass you can now call yourself as LPT or professional. Ang sarap si Tenga, right? Ang sarap pakinggan. And as for your family, magiging proud sila sa iyo. And most importantly, makakatulong ka na sa kanila for all their sacrifices sa iyo. Tip number two, understanding the concept. Because in taking the let, it is more on application more on real life situation so if you really understand the concept so you find the exam easy for you to answer bear this into your mind let is not just to those who are intelligent but for those who know how to comprehend kasi ako hindi talaga ako nakapag-review ng maigi kasi I'm a lazy type of person if hawak ako ng review materials, I felt sleepy. Nakakapag-aral lang ako kapag nasa review center ako. So, my schedule in reviewing is weekends. So, Monday to Friday, nasa bahay ako, walang ginagawa. So, that's why masasabi ko, based on my experience, if you know how to comprehend, you really can answer the exam. So tip number three, take down notes. This is very effective to me because I am not a studious as what I have said a while ago that hindi ako nakapag-aral ng, ma ng maigi as I took the let. But in my review center, they encourage us to take down notes. They won't allow us to take a picture on the slides. If they caught us, malalagot ka talaga. Taking down notes kasi will help you retain information or knowledge into your mind. Nare-recall ng ating mind ang mga isinulat natin. That's why it's very effective and very helpful sa akin na hindi nakapag-aral ng maigi. 
Tip number four, relax. Take time to relax. If you're tired of reading your review materials, then stop. Learn to rest if you are tired. Don't force yourself to read and to read and to read and to read even though your mind is too tired of receiving information. Tip number five, pray. I can say that prayer is the greatest weapon I used as I took the exam. Kasi right from the start, nung hindi pa ako nakapag-graduate ng college, I started praying to God that He will help me pass the let. I always talk to God to guide me and gave me knowledge, wisdom, comprehension, and presence of mind. Even though I already passed the let, till now, I still thank God because He hears my prayer. Every night before I sleep, I always say to God that I'm very grateful for the opportunity. And lastly, you should not forget the Almighty God after he gave you what you have prayed for so that's it guys i hope that you've learned something and don't forget to like share and subscribe and click the notification bell for more updated videos thank you